In this video, you will learn. What is difference between Draeger Polytron 5100EC and Draeger Polytron 5310IR? What do we need in calibration kit? And how to do calibration of both models? First of all, what is main difference between two models? Draeger Polytron 5100EC is explosion-proof transmitter for the detection of toxic gases or oxygen. Whereas Draeger Polytron 5310IR is explosion-proof transmitter for the detection of flammable gases in the lower explosion limit. 5100EC uses plug-and-play electrochemical sensor to detect specific gases. Whereas Polytron 5310 uses Draeger infrared or IR sensor which can be configured for methane, propane or ethylene. Polytron 5100EC comes with 2 or 3 wire with 4 to 20 mA analog output with relays. Whereas Polytron 5310 comes with 3 wire with 4 to 20 mA analog output with relays. What do we need in calibration kit? First of all, we need magnetic wand. You have to have magnetic wand to access menu function. Second thing is zero gas bottle and span gas bottle. Third thing is gas regulator. Last thing is small Tigon tube. Now, how to access menu function of Draeger Polytron 5000 series. In order to access menu function of Polytron 5000 series, press magnetic wand to down button one by one. And you can see zero adjustment, span adjustment, 4 to 20 test, alarm 1 test, alarm 2 test, fail test, alarm 1 set, alarm 2 set, and many other function. When desired function appears on the screen, press OK button to set the value or to check the parameter value. Zero calibration. In order to start zero calibration, press magnetic wand to down button at once. Display will show zero and adjustment. Press OK button to enter in zero adjustment mode. If target gas present in atmosphere where sensor is located, apply the zero gas to sensor. And if there is no gas present, then do not need to apply zero gas. In other words, zero calibration will be done and open to air. Now, wait till value stabilized. If value is not 0.0, .0 parts per million, then use up or down button to make it zero and press OK button after this. Zero calibration is done, and you can see screen flashes between zero and adjustment. Span calibration. In order to access span calibration option, press down button at once when display flashes between zero and adjustment. When display flashes between span and adjustment, press OK button to enter in span menu. When display flashes between low and gas, turn on the regulator of span gas bottle and apply the gas to sensor. Here, make sure that you apply correct concentration gas to sensor. For example, if you want to set 25 ppm as span value, then use 25 ppm hydrogen sulfide gas bottle. Gas concentration value will increase and you can see the value on display. Wait for 2 minutes till value reached to concentration of gas bottle. For example, if you are using 25 ppm hydrogen sulfide gas then value will increase near to 25 ppm. If the value is more or less than 25 ppm then use up or down button to adjust the value to 25 ppm. And press OK button to set span value. Span calibration is done. And display will flash between span and adjustment. Now, press up button two times to go back to measurement mode. In other words, tap up button until menu exited. 
Here, you can see the alarm LED start to blink, if the gas concentration is above the alarm set point. If the alarm's relays are configured with horn and strobe, strobe light and horn will turn on. Alarms can be reset by pressing OK button anytime. Thank you friends for watching this video. I hope you really like this video. Please give me your valuable feedback in comment box. If you do not want to miss calibration video like this, please subscribe my channel and hit the bell icon.